Yeah. 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 Come on. Welcome. Good evening. Sean X coming at you here. It's late night money. Look at headlines. It's Friday now because it's two minutes after midnight. Friday the 5th. That's what it says right there. Late night money for Friday the 5th. Welcome on into the show. Hit the like button if you haven't already. It's here on YouTube. Sean Higgs, one of free picks at Mr. Sean Higgs on Twitter. Come even follow. And as always, you could listen after the fact to the late night or midday money show on uh, podcast form. Wherever you listen to your podcast. So there's that. There's that bit of great news for everybody. Podcast available. All right. Let's um, get to a lot of baseball games to go over for tomorrow. Seems to be a full slate. Of action. Uh, we'll do a quick little recap from today. Not a bad day. I can't complain. We had uh, some player props. Two guys did not play. Arnado got a ribby plus 150. Tim Anderson got a run plus 190. We lost a ribby on Anderson, but hey, go two and one with a plus 190 and plus 150. That's not too bad. That's plus 140 in your pocket. 11 and 13. Now I'll put up the little number there for us. There you go. Uh, 14, uh, well, that's not the player prop. That's 11 and 13 plus 470. And then our picks today, we did split out with the Tigers 1-1. One and one. Still picked up a couple bucks there. So uh, 14 and 10 plus 450. Hockey 20 and 20 plus 50. There's, oh, there's no NBA. Don't have NBA in there. 43 and 38 plus 345. I'll have to add those in. Doesn't make a difference. I'm not adding any NBA at the end of the year here. Ridiculous nonsense. Uh, Who did I like today? Uh, Kings, again, didn't bet them. Loser. Glad I didn't play them there. So, no thank you to some NBA. And tomorrow, what do you got? We got a bunch of more. I got a couple couple ones out here, huh? Knicks, Bulls are a one. Miami, Houston's a one. We got a one and a half Detroit, Memphis. A couple low lines, but not interested. Not interested. I, I did like the Capitals. They ended up losing. Glad I didn't bet because I would have been a loser. But I was not a loser. I had a nice uh, day today. I go 2-1 uh, and one on the sites. Not too shabby. St. Louis run line, never in doubt. Detroit splits. We will take it. I also had KC over. I mentioned that uh, in the chat. I like that KC over. Ended up playing that for myself. I didn't get it in on the uh, channels right away, but... Excuse me, as I see. You know how it is. I'm live. I'm always start sneezing. 23 and 14, 62% of my uh, NFL, my MLB so far to start the year. And close to the video, we have 14 and 10. But let's get into um, – there's a couple comments, and then we'll get to the to the games. I'll go over them real fast. Michael A is coming in. Good morning. How are you? I am good. Winning day for me, Michael. Card team total over four and a half, never in doubt. That's for sure. Easy winner. Should be called stealing and not gambling when they nice one like that. Uh card scene total run line parlay, never in doubter. And we got the say yeah, seventh inning he busted it open. Locking in with the king is in the house. How are you tonight? Groovy's here. Andrew Wiggins at first basket plus seven hundred. Groovy loves the first basket props. The burger home run prop cashed as well. How about taking steps? Team total of four and a half today. Yeah, I, I don't hate that one. Oh, I sort of wanted to take – we'll get to that game in a second. I sort of wanted to take the Diamondbacks, nice plus $2 doggy there. Uh, but it is Mr. Henry. Uh, and that that Atlanta – I think Atlanta lineup's uh, the best in the bigs. I think it's better than the, the, the Dodger lineup for sure. For sure. Uh, I'm not game. Run's really bad. They take the lead and boom. Good game over. I, I was shocked – that they took a lead, that they scored runs at all. Okay, I told you that when you said, oh, man, Marlins today. I'm like, well, they haven't hit. They had bad pitching. And sure enough, the pitching killed them again. Came back to kill them. Cost them the game. Uh, run line action, Spencer on Hill. Yeah, I don't you know I don't know if we do run line on that. I, I, I want to actually kind of take Arizona in that spot, but the Strider is my guy. You know that. Uh Next in the like button today with decent day under Hawks, one on the ice with the Penguins, one on the over in Pittsburgh, one lost Marlins. That's hey, listen, a winning day is a winning day. Don't matter how you get there. Go 
go three and four with some dogs. You go four and two with faves. Take the wins. Groovy Higgs, all correct on the rows. Team total. Yeah. Mike Soroka, I told you. I told you. How is his, you know what, let me look real fast. Because my guy pounded it was like, hey, he called me. He's like, take the under with his strikeouts. He said, it was like three and a half. How many strikeouts do you have? Two. He said the other day, in his, the other day, his last start, he had all the pitches he threw. He only had two strikes that were swings and misses. Like, so he doesn't strike anybody out. And again, he had two today. I'm shocked he went six innings. Um, Money on Michael's cash to KC team total over in three and a half. And the Pirates team total over. The Pirates got there. I sort of like that over. Again, I, I thought that line, again, yesterday plus 150 or minus 150. We did not like the Pirates today. It's a little later with Perez, but take the wins, Money on Michael. Tomorrow over Demon, uh, Demon Back Swish. Diamond Backs for Nick. Against the Braves, under Jays, Moneyline Giants, Reds, and Angels. Gindy says the Hall stuns the home Indiana State crowd downtown. Any brutal, great job, by Holland. Yeah, man, nine zero run to end it. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Indiana State blew the game. Also hit over six and a half Tampa on the ice. Good win there in the back to backs. But I should have had him because I liked that Tampa over yesterday. It was a loser. He came back today. Got it. Nick Nasty's in the house. Good evening, Nick. Seen Hall winner. Yes, it was. Gonna take cards. Fish game over, but shot away. Fish game. Listen, Marlins are bad. King D saying hello to Nick. Nick will say hello to back. We're gonna jump into the banner section and start talking some Major League Baseball because we got a full slate of games. I will be doing the midday money tomorrow, as always. Again, nothing official here in the chat right now because, I, I, you know, it's just. I don't know why. All right, sorry. So I know I'm gonna I'm gonna I'll go tell you every single game what I like in each of them, and then you come back and if I have a play that I bet, you'll hear about it. Jays and the Yanks, Stroman and Kikuchi. Ah, again, these are earlier lines. I'm gonna you know let me pop up the uh, updated lines here for a second. We'll get to those, and then I'll get see see if they've moved from. Earlier this evening. All right. I got a, a 145, eight and a half. And I basically see, I see a couple 150s popping up here. But basically 145. I, you know, I, I if it was a little more, I would take Toronto, believe it or not. I know that's the Yanks. Well, look at this. We're, we're six and one. We're really good. Come back from a road trip. Stroman, it's an old team. I mean, the guy's been on a few teams. The Jays have not been hitting. Honestly, if anything here, maybe a run line. Run line of Yankees plus 140 on the run line. I look at that just simply because Toronto has not been hitting at all. At all. Run line, Yanks. That's my lean here. I said I liked Oakland the other day. I said this would be the spot for them. I like JP Sears. I like Scooble too, and I got a Tiger over. Right? We got the Tiger over prop. We're 5-1. We're, we're looking good. I haven't bet this, but I got Oakland in caps here because I said on Wednesday that this is the spot I want to look at taking the A's here. Detroit's off a double dip, a late afternoon double dip. Used a couple pitchers in both games. Okay. I didn't bet this game. Yeah, the A's are terrible. I under yeah, yeah, Higgs, I, yeah, they're bad. I know they're bad. Spot wise, you're gonna give me a two to one on a team versus a team off a double dip and used how many pitchers they use? Seven pitchers in a double header between the two games. Let's check it out. Two oh game, guys throwing a no hitter. They pull them. They lose two to one. Three pitchers go that game. Starter two relievers. And then in the first game, they pull it out late. In extra, we have the starter. And then one, two, three, four, five more pitchers. Everybody's going an inning. 
Now, it's seven games into the season. You should be fresh. You're a professional athlete. I'm just saying from the standpoint, I kind of like the A's. Haven't bet them, but my, my thoughts have not changed since Wednesday. This is a spot where I bet on spots. Dodgers, Cubbies, Bobby Miller, Kyle Hendricks. Uh, I do not like Kyle Hendricks one bit. And as you know, I hear me crush the Dodgers here. 160 on the road. Uh, hey, listen, you want to do a run line here? I get it. I got another sneeze coming on, so you got to stand by here. Man, I don't sneeze. I'm sitting out. I'm watching this ridiculous crap. The the Invincibles or some nonsense on Amazon. We got the kids like, oh, let's watch whatever. They watch it. I I try to watch. I can't watch it. Freaking. Anyway, so I was just sitting there. Nothing. I come in here. All hell breaks loose. I got to sneeze. I got. I start coughing. It's like, well, I'm looking around like like I'm some kind of savage. I, mean, I got a clean little room. Anyway, I'm sorry. Anyway, back to the, the Dodgers. Do I want to lay 160? No. Do I like Kyle Hendricks? Not at all. Is it is it a basic play here? Now, the total seven. Do we just run back to our Dodger team total over four and a halves? I don't hate it. Ball carrying. You know, it's a win. It's blown in. I don't know, man. Kyle Hendricks, not for me. Team total is good. I'm writing it down in my book. That's that'll be an official play tomorrow. Dodgers team total over. Next up, we got the Rays and the Rockies. Uh, staring at a one sixty to one sixty five total, twelve and a half. Latell and Gomber. Great matchup here. Um, twelve and a half. Did, did you just go over? What's there to say about the Rockies? One and six. Don't look too good out of the gate. Nine eight loser. Twelve two loser. Five nothing. Five one. Nine four. Seven three. Sixteen to one. Yikes. Do I want to get a minus one ten run line on a road? I don't know about that. This would be a prime example. I know Mr. Numbers. Hey, the Tampa only steals signs at home, gets the offense going. I don't know. This this Colorado staff, this team looks bad. I would again, no thank you. I'm not betting this game. I won't be betting this game at all. No no thank you. But you're here. I'm telling you it would be a run line play or a team total. Team total first, I think. O's and the Pirates, uh, 130. I see anywhere from – this is weird. I see from a, a 125 to a 145 on this game here uh, right now. So you can get a little plus money on the Pirates. Run line for my guy, Grace Rodriguez. As much as I love Strider, here comes Grayson. I love – I got a Cy Young on this kid. Uh, you want to do a run line plus 125? Eh, total 8.5. Obviously, I'm leaning the O's here with Grace Rodriguez. It's, it's a kid I like. The team's pretty good. Uh, Pirates, okay, nice little start. I don't want to take away from the, the Pirates coming out of the gates 5-1. and one. But how bad have the Marlins been this season? And the, and the Nationals, they're supposed to be a last-place team. Now you got the O's. You, you, come, you beat Baltimore two out of three? I might change my tune on you, April or not. Uh, we saw them start last year with a couple wins. I don't think so. Uh, this Oriole team is really good. Padres, Giants, Cease, and Jordan Hicks. It's a it's a plus one hundred five for the Padres, minus one fifteen for the Giants. Michael B might be in the chat. He'll let you let, let let his thoughts be known on his his team here, his home team. I see eights. I also see a seven and a half. I would actually lean towards an over. Again, we saw these guys play. We've seen overs. We have seen overs from 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 these squads. I mean, it was six four eight three nine six thirteen four. Hello, that was last week. I mean, nothing like playing your 
rival. I mean, I, I get the Dodgers are rival, but they're still Padres, are still NL West team. You got a you got a seven seven games in the first ten, first thirteen. I don't know. Uh, over for me. Over, over, over. Although we might get some weather information and play to the under, but. What we saw Adam in the first series, I'm going to have to think over is the play. Oh, the Mets and the Reds. Oh, the Mets. You push Quintana back to start on the road here. I got to say, Hunter Green, I think his strikeout props will be a little juicy, probably a little pumped up a little bit. I'm seeing anywhere from 120 to 125. Reds for me. Uh, lineup's better than the Mets. I don't care. You needed a miracle. To, to break up a, a no hitter to score a run. Were they gonna? Ooh, we're on our way now. That's gonna be a long season, Mets fans. Reds, they got a little hype to themselves. So give me the uh, Reds here. Probably should have put the Reds in cap. Phillies and the Natties, Nola and Patrick Corbin. Are you kidding me with this? Phillies on the road, laying a one eighty spot here. Uh, total of nine. I almost want to come in and take Corbin and the Nats. I mean, Aaron Nola is getting a number. I, yeah, the lineup's great. Oh, look at Bryce Harper. Hey, three homers. Yeah, he's super borderline Hall of Famer, Trey Turner. Probably a Hall of Famer before Bryce, if you're asking me. Can, can we look at Aaron Nola's numbers? And there's Philly fans here. Please chime in, Philly fans. 17 and 6, 237 ERA, Aaron Nola. How's it 2018? 2021. That's, that's when the ERA starts going up. 463, 9 and 9. 11 and 13. 12 and 9 last year. He still strikes guys out. And again, that to me in today's baseball don't mean nothing. Everybody just strikes out a guy every inning because everybody strikes out 100 times. 150. Yeah, guys strike out 200 times. And Corbin's, uh, this is not some, hey, Patrick Corbin's good to keep this lineup a check. Uh, that's not what I'm saying at all. I mean, the guy gave up seven hits of four innings last game. And if we, let's we talk about old DRAs. Last year, 520, 631. 582, 466. I mean, that's in 32, 31, 31 starts. So I would lean Nats, but honestly, uh, this over, nine. Uh, you know what? If I can find an eight, is there an eight and a half around? If you can find an eight and a half, get the eight. I'm, I'm going to go over this game. Let's go over the total. The Nationals uh, have been kind of overing this season. What do we got? One, two, three. Four or five overs? Five or six overs for these guys? You're giving up seven? Well, you won one, five, three. Eight, six, six, and eight. Yeah. Do yourselves a favor. That's over. That's over nine. I wrote it down, and I'll be taking it when I wrap this show up. Arizona. Here we go. My guy Strider. Cy Young Strider. Best pitcher, I don't care. You can say Cole is. This guy is a beast. 265, eight and a half, showing at circa here. I'm, uh, listen, run line is minus 130. Ah, I, like I said, I sort of wanted to take Arizona. If somebody else was pitching, sure. Uh, this one, it's going to be a brave. The pen is out. Atlanta team total over for tomorrow. I will add it to the chat. I will post it in the chat when we get through the rest of these games. Uh, I, again, I don't have the team totals in front of me, but they will be up here. Uh, Sox and Royals. Now, it's easy to come and be like, hey, let's just take the Royals again. They had a crazy inning, scored a lot of runs. I like Brady Singer. Bad year last year. Solid rookie season before that. I can't lay 180. Now, Fetty's a bad pitcher. Now, do we want to do a run line minus uh, plus 115? Right. Perfect for me. Perfect. You want to do Royals no bottom nine? 
Super. Super. 180. No, thank you. And uh, that's the, the, the White Sox. Forget about the White Sox. Stroh is laying a 135 spot. Actually, I'm seeing 130s now with Hunter Brown. I like Hunter Brown. He's my guy. They uh, rookie of the year on him last year. Didn't get there. He fell apart down a down a stretch because that's what happens when you're a rookie pitcher and your bullpen is taxed and overworked by the first week of July. And you know you and JP France are coming out and hitting your innings limits that you maxed out from years before in in August. You're gonna get you get roughed up by major league hitters when you lose some speed. Now, in this spot here, we got a nine and a half. I'm going to say I want to take the Rangers here, believe it or not. I, I like the Rangers lineup better. I love Yordi. I love Kyle Tucker. I love, you know, Pena, I, Chance McCormick. I, it's a great – you got Bray. I didn't even talk about Altuve. I don't know. You're going to give me the Rangers here at home plus money? I'd have to lean that way. I'd have to lean that way. Uh, Seattle at the Brewers. I – uh. I want to take the Brewers. I was looking at the Seattle lineup. Like two guys are hitting over like two hundred. It's it's just terrible, and I don't want to go under because we've seen. And again, they have basically kind of played unders both teams, but they're weird. It's like four threes that are kind of almost getting to eights. So I'm not loving that part of it. But you know, Sam Peralta, I think he's the real deal. And I like Logan Gilbert, so it's like, what do I want to do here? You know, I don't have any action in this one. I, a part of me leans Milwaukee, although I like I like to see how to line up better, even though they're not hitting. It'll be a pass for me, one hundred percent. Sox and the Angels. I like the Angels here. I mean, forget about the Sox losing to the A's. A's are going to win a game or two. They'll come in and, and score one. That was more on the. Sox, even in the game before that, what they won, not cover what they win, one nothing or two two one, whatever that was. This poor hitting. I like Griffin Canning, and uh, not you know Cutter Crawford's all right, another young guy. I want to say Angels here. I, I got a short price, one ten. You know we could if you want to get crazy, right? We could go we could go T money style. You know T money was like, hey, let's lay the two and a half with the with the Tigers in both games. He wants to run those run lines. You want to take a 180 with the Angels here? I might take a 180 with the Angels myself. Run line. All right. We're going to do the comments. Say hello to everybody because we have more. Uh, Phillies team total over four and a half. Yeah, I can see that. That's why I kind of like the over. I think we see some runs here. It's going to be an official play, Michael A. Nats over nine. Best show live at midnight. Back to bed. <laughs> Patton just wakes up to, to hit the like button. He leaves. Thank you. Michael, like, maybe some O's run line 26 for boy Rodriguez. Uh, yeah, I don't hate it. I mean, if you want to lead at 130, I don't hate it, Mike. David, Sean, you need a humidifier in, in the closed room. Is that what it is? It's just, it's just bizarre. Like, and I'm thinking, all right, it's April. But I listen, it's, I don't open windows. I, got open. I said, I will never open windows in Texas. You're out of your mind. I got freaking bug. I don't know what to tell these. I, we have bug. They look like mosquitoes. I don't even know what they are. They're this big, but apparently they just eat the other mosquitoes that are this big. It's, it's like I'm in a freaking horror movie with crazy bugs. So it's not even like I have like pollen or stuff sitting around. And I wipe my stuff down. I'm not some savage. I, I keep a nice, clean area here. You see, if you've seen on Sean Higgs, and I do like the uh, the cards. I mean, sometimes you get the whole uh, the whole room. You see what it's like. It's not messy at all. Thirty. Michael Panza I took Seen Hall yesterday at plus three and took them the night before tip off of three and a half. Sweat it out for a great game. Should have grabbed some money line on them. Mike, you like them that much? What do you think they're gonna lose by a point? Good win for the Hall. South Orange in the house. Pinky Pick says the Rays tomorrow. Listen, Pinky. I'm not going to be the one to come in and uh, co-sign on laying 160 run li- or 160 money line teams on the road. I can't. And I yes, the Rockies are bad. If you want to do a team total, sure. I can't say yes to 160. 
But should they win? Absolutely. That's just not. I can't do that. Mike Essen has thoughts on Kikuchi, Stroman, Yanks. I'm open tomorrow. Yanks been rolling. Winner six or seven. I think I might do a uh, Yankee run line there. I might do a Yankee run line. Pirates are on fire last year, too. Remember what happened? Give me some. Grayson Rodriguez. G-Rod. They did start out hot last year. And again, could I see them starting a little better this year? Sure. I mean, Cruz, Henry Davis, we got Brian Reynolds. Uh, Brian Hayes was hitting the ball finally. It's all about the pitching, though. And that pitching staff, Mitch Keller, we were running to love Mitch Keller. You know, I mean, Ronzi, you know, where's Ronzi Contreras? Remember that guy? Uh, I mean, Jared Jones, Skeens is supposed to come up. I mean, they, JT Brubaker was supposed to be the race two years ago. And they, they just ran to the Yankees. Uh, you know, again, the the, the Baltimore team uh, is definitely more complete right now. I guess if you had to pick a money line pick or taking the running Yanks tomorrow, I, uh, money, I, I can't do Yankee. I mean, the Yankee line, like I said, that's. I don't like laying more than 140, 150. So this would be, you know, maybe 160 top. You want to do Yankee run line or money line? Uh, I, I think so. Toronto just has not hit. And we've seen the Yankees, they start a little slow, but, you know, they're getting the they're getting to the bullpens. That's like, oh, that's like old school Yankees. That's like, you know, the late 90 Yankees, right? Championship Yankees. They'd, they'd be in these dog fights and all of a sudden they just maul when these relievers would come in. And that's what they've done so far, right? They got the Houston relievers. Arizona game late goes over. I had the under, so I'm a little bitter on that one. And Toronto, they're not doing much hit at all. You want to do Yankees? Okay. I prefer the run line. Pinky picks 06 Padres. I like the over in the Padres Giants. We saw them play last week. Bunch of overs. Bunch of overs. I'll go back to the over well. And Pinky is in Mexico. Where are you down in Mexico? Where are you at? In Veracruz? Oaxaca? Where are you at? Michael A. Dodgers team total not available. You don't have all things. No, yeah, no. No team totals up, probably. Uh, i got to wait for lineups or something to come up. Confirm pitchers. But Dodgers team total over and Brave team total over, I think, are. Well, they are. I wrote them down. So they'll be in the chat. That's basically blew it up last year. And that was fine. I don't mind the Mets blowing it up last year. And it, it, that's to me, that's they should have did. Where were they going? You're gonna you you could dump payroll. You're gonna eat the payroll anyway. That's fine. You got something back, right? They got some prospects. I'm just gonna write in. Uh, so I'm not gonna look at you, the screen here, Mike. Uh, you traded away two old pitchers, who I thought was were gonna come back. Uh, and bite you in the butt anyway. You needed everything to go right for them to have great years. So, yeah, swallow them, get two prospects that are pretty decent, and wait this year. Now, the problem was you thought maybe we were going to go after Otani or somewhere. Like, oh, we got to get this guy. What is their plan going forward here? You know, I don't mind them not spending money. I'm not even a Mets fan, but I don't mind. That's where you're you going. You're not beating the Braves. Who are you bringing in that you're going to leapfrog Philly and the Braves? Heck, as bad as the Marlins are, the Marlins could get hot with their pitching and, and leapfrog you. So uh, w- what is the plan going forward? Are you going to trade Alonzo? Are you keeping Alonzo? Are, are you rally, You know, you're going to build and rally around Brett Batty and Ronnie Mercuro and uh, the catcher? Alvarez, Nemo, McNeil. I pitching, pitching. You need pitching. It's all about pitching. Stop Gio's in the house. Good morning. Wishing you the best luck today and tomorrow. Thank you, Gio. Good to see you. Thanks for popping in. But I'm Can we go over in the Phillies game? I got the over Phillies game. It's going to be official. I wrote it down. That's over tomorrow. Gio says so far he's on the Cubbies against the Dodgers, Blue Jays money line, Padres money line, Reds money line, Tigers run line. Red Sox and Moneyline and Mariners. Wow. I just told you I liked opposite all these. I said I liked Brewers. I 
like the Angels. I said I might do Angels run line plus 180. Uh, I sort of like the A's plus $2. I like the Reds. I like the Giant Padre over. And I'd say Yankee run line. Although coming back from the road trip again, I, I, I haven't bet it. Phillies team total. Yes, take the Philly team total over. Love the Phillies Nats over. Yeah, I, I'm probably going to – well, I added the Nats over for the, t- the game over. Phillies Nats over nine. Um. Might do a little Philly team total over as well. Lane is in the house. It's nice to catch Lane. I'm running a lot of man in that. I'll land team total in my car for more. Yeah, that, they could hit. They can hit. Just says, make cash out of his money line and pivot to Nerfy if it isn't already juiced to him. That's, a, you know, see, that's fine. You want to go Nerfy with Gilbert and Peralta. Have at it. Big Scott's in the house, my guy. Good to see you. How are you today? Reds kill the Mets tomorrow. I agree with the Reds. The Mets, I, like I said today in the show, picks out. I was like, they're favored in a doubleheader. They haven't won a game all year. Now they're going to win two? You almost lost two. You could have won two. Could have lost two. You end up splitting. I make some money. I'm happy. Uh, but, yeah, like uh, I'm a Hunter Green guy. I like Hunter Green. It's Hunter Green strikeout machine, but his numbers are way too high. Uh, that's not the banner I was going to pull up. I was going to pull up the uh, – that banner. So Nats over. Dodger team total over. Braves team total over. I don't know. Do I add the brew? Do I add the uh, brew crew with a little Peralta? Oh, he looks good. He looks good. Maybe a little Peralta Cy Young. I mean, I don't know. Anyway, all right. That's that's it for tonight. We ran them all down. Nats over, gets a call. And Dodgers and Braves team total, we'll be looking at for tomorrow when they pop up. Maybe a couple more ads. Like I said, uh, like the Angels, Lean and Brewers, uh, Royals run line. I, you know, I can't just the White Sox are. <laughs> it's got two, like, Royal. I bet the Royals run line early in 180. Unbelievable. Ugh. Scooby Dooby Dooble over his K's tomorrow versus the Oakland Athletics. I don't hate that. I like Scooble. I like, I was saying with Oakland, I sort of like the $2 just because they're off the doubleheader. They use seven pitchers, seven relief pitchers today. I don't know. You know, he's, I, you got to like the K prop because maybe they let him go an extra inning or so here, right? No. That's why I kind of like the A's. Again, didn't bet the A's. Just think it's a good spot for the A's. If it hits, I'm a genius. If I bet it, I'm even the Sparta genius. I haven't yet. I have not yet. All righty. I will see everybody tomorrow at noon. Have a good night. And uh, that's it. Thanks for tuning in. Hit the like button. Thank you.